Girl, shut up. We need to mark. <laughs> we need to identify the conjugate of that term. This is your A. This is your B. For your conjugate, guys, the A term does not change. So this will become what? Negative. Two. Two. And this is where you do the opposite of your B term, which is what? Oh, yeah. Six. 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 Who's not a genius? So, right? My A term does not change, but my B term I have to do the opposite. The opposite. Then, I uh, have to multiply my numerator by the conjugate also. Otherwise, my equation will not be balanced. Mr. D says I'm a genius. Now, this is your Shut setup. Up, Chanel. Now, this bit, now we have a difference in the sum. You only do first and last. This multiplied by that, and this multiplied by that. So as your denominator, what is negative two times negative two? That will become positive four. And what is minus six i times plus six i? Positive thirty-six i squared. Jesus. Negative thirty-six i. Squared. No, you always have. So far, so good. Yeah. Then I can come back and simplify that. Now I have to go distribute my farm i as my numerator. I will have five i and negative two will give me negative ten i. Negative ten i. And I will have five i times positive. 6i will give me I positive 30i positive squared. 30i I squared. So we have to do some simplification. Right? Mm -hmm. We know what i squared is equal to. What is i squared? Yeah, yeah. So now I will have negative 30, it's negative 10i, right? Plus 30 times 1. Yeah. Negative 1 as my numerator. Over 4 minus 36 times negative 1. I have to repass my i squared. So far, so good? Mm -hmm. So as my numerator, I end up with negative 10i minus, minus 30 over 4 plus what? 36. We are simplifying still. So we will have minus 10i minus 30 over 36 over 40. 40. We have to simplify one last time. What number do you have in common? Easy. 10. I can cancel the 10, cancel the 10, cancel the 10. And uh, my final answer would be what? Negative i minus 3 over 4. Or I can write it minus 3 minus i over 4. That would be my final outcome. Mr.